Good day, Miss Milagros. I'm Jamie Lynn Safiko Galang from grade 12, class B. This is my oral participation recitation. Discuss how media and information literacy develop students to be creative and critical thinker as well as responsible users and competent producer of media and information. The topic aims to develop students to be creative and critical thinkers in terms of responsible users and competent producers. The, the media and information literacy course introduced the learners to have a basic understanding of media and information as channel of communication and tools for the development of individuals and society. What is the importance of media and information literacy for you as a student? Media literacy is essential because it helps people understand the messages that are being communicated to them. With so many sources of information today, media literacy can help people identify reliable sources and filter through the nose to get at the truth. How can you describe a responsible user and competent producer of media information? A responsible user and competent producer of media and information should have this characteristic must be curious, general knowledge, the ability to write. What is the power of media and information and the responsibility of the user? The power of media lies in the hands of its users, thus are responsible for the effect of what they do or are about to do. That being said, with great power comes with great responsibility. The users are so, so solely responsible for their content, such as photos, videos, and captions. How can media and information improve the student learning environment? Existing media resources can also be used to be engaged students and faci facilitate active learning strategies, which, which promote deeper learning. For example, media provides a useful platform for teaching with cases, cooperative learning, problem solving, and giving more interactive lecture demonstrations. What literacy helps the student develop critical thinking and active participation in our media culture. Media analysis, which is a critical part of media literacy education, can help a critical thinking skill by straightening observation and interpretation. How do you develop media literacy? How to improve your media literacy skill? Know what you're up against. Every platform wants you to spend as much as as much time as possible on it. Think carefully about how you frame a search. How we phrase a search makes all the difference. Think critically about keywords. Our keywords matter. Say Tripodi never stop learning. How do you develop media literacy? How to improve your media literacy skills? Know what you're up. How do media literacy, information literacy, and technology literacy, and media and information literacy differ in terms of us? The main difference between the information literacy and media literacy is that information literacy is the ability to identify that there is a need for information and locate information, evaluate and use this information effectively to solve a problem, whereas media literacy is the ability to access, evaluate, manipulate, and produce. And that's all po, ma. Salamat po.